Hi and welcome back. We're going to go ahead and walk you through the process of creating a digital badge using the online badgemaker.com website. Uh, digital badges are a great way to recognize a variety of different skills in online courses and they're part of the gamification of learning process. But let's go ahead and talk a little bit about how you might create one of those badges. So there's a lot of different programs and tools out there. I've just really enjoyed the online badge maker program because it's got a lot of customization and it's free so you can't beat that. So when you get to the site go ahead and click create a badge and that's going to take you into the studio and it tends to start you off at this button layout part there's a couple of different cool tools here one you can kind of customize and change the type of 3d button that uh, that you have i kind of like this one it looks a little concave and 3d so that looks cool and you can also add or change the shadow so maybe we'll uh we'll go with this one it just has kind of like a nice little drop shadow circling the uh circling our badge there that point we'll move into the background and go ahead and change the color of our background I think I want to make a yellow badge today so we'll set the color as yellow and go ahead and close that out now at this point if I wanted to I could upload and attach a picture specific to the badge if I had something that I wanted to use for that I don't or I could go ahead and click on the button here to add some text if I wanted the name on the badge. Um, I don't think I want to do that today. I want to go a little bit more simplistic and basic inside of this. We're going to go for the minimalist badge. So I'm going to click on add shape. And you can see that there are a variety of different shapes and icons that you can use to add to your badge based on what your interests are. So what I was thinking today is to create a badge that recognized a good idea. So when a student has a really good idea in the class or they come up with something, this is a badge that I could manually assign them to recognize that good creative thinking. So I'm thinking the light bulb would probably be a good, uh, good icon. And let's go ahead and just make it a really simple black, uh, black line art inside of here. Take it all the way down to all zeros. Close that and we've got this nice simple black light bulb. Now I'm just going to go ahead and center it on my badge so that it looks pretty much even. It looks pretty close. And we're going to go ahead and go with that. And I'm just going to leave everything else here to the normal. Uh, looks like my layers are happy. I'm happy with it. And bam, I've created the badge that I want for my course. At this point, I can go ahead and click the create button and it'll give me a variety of different options. But today we're just going to click the save immediately to my computer that'll download the badge and then I can go ahead and use it as I would like in one of my uh, classes and you can see that it's uh, bringing it up in my image program well that's all there really is to it so good luck and get started making some badges